The actions of our deputy compromised trust, disturbed operational efficiency, and caused significant harm toward women both in law enforcement and in our community. Sheriff Derek Sanders Press release by Thurston County Sheriff Derek Sanders September 10, 2024 Re, TCSO deputy disciplined, suspended without pay. In July of 2023, TSCO launched an internal investigation in the conduct of a deputy. The complaint alleged that the deputy took a recording from his body cam footage without my consent, posted it to social media, and used that footage to make a disparaging comment toward a female officer, stating that women don't belong in law enforcement. The deputy also self-reported their actions. After a thorough investigation, discrimination allegations were substantiated. At the end of the complaint process, I determined that a suspension without pay and remedial training was appropriate discipline. The Deputy Sheriff's Association leadership filed a grievance, arguing the discipline was too severe and didn't qualify as discrimination. I denied the grievance, leading to an arbitration hearing for final resolution. While waiting the decision of the arbitrator, the Deputy Sheriff Association leadership wrote a complaint letter to the Board of County Commissioners, alleging that I violated employee due process, refused to settle the case, and accused TCSO command staff of leading an emotionally charged and biased investigation. Last week, the arbitrator ruled exclusively in my favor by denying the grievance and upholding the imposed discipline. Furthermore, the arbitrator asserted that due process was in fact followed, that efforts were made to settle the matter prior to arbitration, the investigation was fair and objective, and that the discipline met the requirements of just cause under state law. The actions of our deputy compromised trust, disturbed operational efficiency, and caused significant harm toward women both in law enforcement and in our community. I fully expect that this marks the closure of this matter so that all impacted parties can move forward. If Thurston County Sheriff's Office is to succeed, our workplace must be one that is inclusive to all persons regardless of their race, color, religion, gender, or any other class of people subject to discrimination. Women excel in this profession, providing value contributions and perspective throughout our ranks. Thurston County Sheriff's Office will not tolerate discrimination of any kind and will continue to go to whatever lengths necessary to ensure fair discipline is imposed with remedial training when applicable. Thurston County Sheriff Derek Sanders We attempted to locate the video referenced by Sheriff Sanders in the complaint. Unfortunately we were unable to find it, so we will show this totally unrelated video. My name is Deputy Wade Sandoval, I'm 26 years old, I'm currently on field training and uh, I've been with the Sheriff's Office for about 6-7 months. Uh, so before law enforcement, um, I was in the Army, I was in the military for a little over 7 years and I did um, communication stuff, radios, networking, things like that. Uh, the Police Academy is, is a, it's a good experience, it's a lot of information, it's kind of um, a lot of different topics, trying to learn little bits and pieces at once, so it's just a lot of information thrown at you, um, but it's definitely, it's a good experience, and um, I think the a lot of the TAC officers up there are um, really experienced good guys that know their stuff and uh, great instructors to have. Uh, so my free time, I like, uh, I like playing golf as much as I can. Much as I can. Uh, also, I enjoy duck hunting and um, I enjoy sports. I like going to uh, baseball games if I can, and um, I like to play a little bit of volleyball, but yeah. Uh, favorite football team is the Eagles, unfortunately. Uh, so if you're thinking about a career in law enforcement, I'd say just start prepping early. Um, start, start doing research on areas that you might want to work. Start looking into different agencies and what they have to offer. and. Um, different programs they have, start familiarizing yourself, uh, definitely keep your nose clean, um, and yeah, just kind of just start mentally preparing yourself to set yourself up for the most success. So favorite favorite one, a live PD is classic, but uh, I would say First 48 is probably uh, one that I like to watch a little bit more than anything else. Uh, so I'm a, you know, very outgoing. I love talking to people and um, I really, pre you know, enjoy a good sense of humor. So uh, if you come across me anywhere, don't definitely uh, try and come up and see if you can make me laugh a little bit. What does a nosy pepper do? It gets jalapeno business. <laughs> Bye.
Folks, there is so much unfolding every single day, and I'm here to bring you the information as quickly as possible. If you enjoyed the content in today's video, please give it a like and subscribe to the channel. As always, I truly appreciate you taking the time to watch this video, and I hope to see you on the next one. Have yourself a fabulous day, and take care.